That bright light's going to show in my eyes. Hello. Hello. Welcome to Waggy's Travels. It's, um, it's the... What? What's the date say? 1st of November it's today. It's 1st of November. Oh, is that... No, you're not allowed to do that in the morning. Yeah, well, I made it's it up. It's afternoon now. I made it up. Oh, okay. So this is one of our daily vlogs. Um, we intended today to review the solar panels for... The clue might be in today's date as to how successful we are at reviewing solar panels. Yeah. To be honest. Yeah. So... But we will find a sunny day. We will. We were going to re review the solar panels for the Bluetti stroke power oak. And we, we went to Lerin to try and do it, didn't we? We did. So we did take you to a beautiful place. Yeah. And we're in Cool Sands now. So we've taken you to another beautiful place. And the sun doesn't want to play. To the point of we've actually got the light on the camera to make it light enough for us to film in here. Yeah. So anyway, so we just ran a corner from home, really. Um, well, just getting out and about, a bit of fresh air. Yeah. So um, it's still relatively mild. I mean, it's November. I can remember bonfire night and, you know, um, gloves and hats and, yeah. you know. Well, when, we've got our coats on, but it's you not. Do, you've got dragon's breath. Yeah. You know, when it's so cold. Yeah. Um, it doesn't feel anything like that, does it? Yeah. Yeah. It's very, very... I mean, we've got to have coats on, but yeah. that's mainly because it's been emptying down with, with rain. rain. yeah, that's true. I mean, when the showers come down, it's uh, like a monsoon. Yeah. It's not, you know, not just a gentle shower. Yeah. Is it, Winnie? No, it's yeah, not. It isn't. And our one of our videos has surpassed all records, hasn't it? Oh. Well, we've had a couple of achievements, haven't we, yeah, in the we last have. week? Yeah, we have. So in the last week, we've passed a million views... Which, so thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yes. We're just about to hit 19,000 subscribers. Again, thank you very much. And when I checked a couple of hours ago, our Bluetti review, which went up less than a week ago, was at 52,000 views. Um, so we're quite excited about yeah, that. Yeah, we are. We're really excited because we didn't do anything more than we normally would do we just did our thing just opened it up had a look find out what it would do i cooked something with it well i cook, cooked a stew with it and dumplings and dumplings well and i did i did for the other one that we reviewed yeah for the jackery but the jackery um i think people should check out both to, as a you know yeah i mean if I, I must admit if we had either a bigger power oak or a smaller jackery, we could compare. Yeah, we I suppose they both do the same thing, but one's much more capacity. Yeah, higher, so the jackery is, is yeah. huge, isn't it? And but, and but but then it's not as light or mobile. Yeah, because it is just a bigger unit. Yeah. So, yeah. but we've got thirty odd. 32,000 views 32, on, on that on one. Jackery, yeah, but I know these are huge numbers, aren't they? I can't, can't believe it. But Winnie yeah. can't believe this. 32,000, I know. Yeah, so... We can't believe that you actually watch this waffle. We're glad you do. Well, they're watching Winnie, really. Yeah. We've yeah. already found this out, haven't we? Yeah, we have, yeah. So, <coughs> oh, oh, there we go. Oh. Winnie. Oh. Oh. So, it's another dog. Winnie got weighed today, and she's four and a half kilos now, aren't you? Yeah, she's not been well, has she? She's she's had an allergic reaction to the flea treatment that they get given. You know the stuff that you um, have to put on between the shoulder blades, like a little pipette type thing. And um, she literally gouged out all the fur on her back end. Yeah. So we came. Out, we went out when we got home. One side of her body was bald, mm. um, which was quite distressing, I have to say. Yeah. Um, but she's all right in herself, aren't you? Hey. So we had to buy. Oh yeah, we bought her a little onesie, didn't oh, we? We'll show you that later. Yeah. We've got a onesie. We bought her a onesie. Stop her from digging, scratching, and nibbling, and whatever else she was doing, which has worked. <laughs> But when I treat her like a baby, put a pup, put a puppy in a onesie, I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> you end up carrying them around, patting their backs and trying to win them. So, 
<laughs> Please tell me it's not just me. <laughs> it's just you. No, a little spine and everything, a little torso in a onesie. It just felt like a little baby. To the <laughs> so, um, yeah, let's hope it's not just me. Oh. So. Right, we're going to go and have a walk around Corsand. Probably going to go and get a coffee, I hope, at the, is it Bar One? I don't know what the place is called. Well, it's very nice food. I'm going to take the dog down onto the beach and yeah. plop a few stones in the water. Yeah. See if she's still daft enough to run in. So we're going to go down and have a coffee there. Then we we'll, can tell you about the ongoing saga of our camper van. So, oh my God, well, we might need something stronger than a coffee. Well, you know, it's all been converted and it's amazing and we have been away in it and we have used it. Um, but I had, um, I had some, a lot of engine issues and I thought, I get, I'll get a recon engine put in it, which is what I did. So I drove all the way from Cornwall to Manchester. Um, I had a recon engine put in it, and um, well, it's really not gone to plan, is it? So I think they just had this old clapped-out engine at the back of the workshop. They've taken our engine out, thought, oh, there's not too much wrong with that. We can flog that on, and we'll put that that rubbish engine in. <laughs> <laughs> and it's all downhill isn't it from manchester down to cornwall so here we had to get it home and um which is what happened and then when you got it back it was very poorly it was got it back it drove back i've got to say it drove back with no issues i drove it back in the middle of the night the roads were clear it came back um i parked it up um turned it off it juddered a bit when i turned it off but i thought no more about it the following morning i went out and started it up clouds of white smoke and the most yeah it clouds of white smoke inside the vehicle as well it? yeah and yeah. inside and outside and a load of clanking coming from the the uh um the engine bay and rac came out and it, first of all the alternator had fell to pieces then they think the valve stem seals have gone um and there's also a a fuel supply issue uh the exhaust is like it, it, the list is just well there's about eight or nine items uh, and unfortunately the company that i dealt with oh, who i won't name at the moment um who have done the engine have not been the most helpful they've just turned around and said well get it back to us and we'll fix it. Um, and I've pointed out that it's their engine issues, that, um, but they won't pay for the recovery. The RAC won't recover it. Recover it? Yeah. Re recover it. Um, so we're in a bit of a real, bit of a catch 22. So, so far it's cost me nearly 400 pounds for my <laughs> garage. Ooh, for my garage, just to start rectifying things so that I can drive it. Anyway, that was the story I was going to tell you while we were having a coffee. But now we need a coffee. But now we need a coffee, so we'll um, we'll think of something else to tell you while we're um, while we're having a coffee. Right, let's go. And you've been to Cor Sands before, so let's go and have a look. See what it's like. Now it's cold. They might not have. All, I mean, I should put a link in somewhere here to previous Cor Sands videos. Yeah. Um, it's worth coming more than once. It is. Yes, and if you're down this way, let us know. Let us know. We can uh, we can meet up. We can meet up, and we can have a a libation. Well, we're hoping to have a bit of a jam. Lots of people. Yeah, coming we are. Up. But unfortunately, the, where we were going to have it. Hey, that's for us to talk about when we get to somewhere to have a coffee. We'll talk about a meet up. Okay. Right. Back in a minute. Bye. We're back. Bye. Well, we've just had a. Where are you gone? Are you there? Mini, this way. We've uh, we've just had a coffee in the uh, in the bay, in the bay, which is the cafe bar restaurant behind us, which mm -hmm. is on Cor Sands. Um, oh, oh. So what we were going to talk? What were we going to talk? Wrong side around. You need to come this side. Sorry, but I will be throwing the ball for winning. Okay. So we were going to talk about. Um, look at this. Yeah, hang on a minute. Look at this. Look at this. Here we go. View from our office. Come on, yeah. 
So yeah, we were gonna we were gonna talk about um, a meetup. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go on. Quick. Walk with you. Quick, quick! She's running. She's running. She's running. She's running. She's running. She's gonna get wet shoes. She's gonna get wet shoes. <laughs> it's there, it's there, it's right in front of you. Quick, 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 quick. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> so, a meetup. Yes. We were going to have a meetup, wasn't we? We were, and it was It was like it was October, but um, where we intended to have the meet. Um, Oh, this is going to go badly wrong again. Where we intended to have the meeting, because of the weather, it was all waterlogged and horrible. Yeah. And um, unfortunately, they said we couldn't have the... If this water comes up true in your face and this way, I'm not going to tell you, all right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we couldn't have the meet, could we? Um, yeah, but it's... Um... Yeah, no, but we could. Uh, it's got just the wrong time of year now. Isn't it, it is now. It is now. Maybe it would so. be nice to organise it in the spring. Yeah. So when you throw on the ball this time, I'm going to come this side of the camera. So, yeah. So we need to sort of look at arranging something for next year. Um, if anyone, I mean, obviously we we'd like to hold it in Cornwall because that's where we are. Um, and I know a lot of you absolutely adore this part of the country as we do. Um, so it would be seem silly. It would seem very silly for us to go somewhere else when we live here. Yeah, it does. It does. Um, so if you uh, if sorry, he's probably driving him nuts and you keep moving about. But if okay. um, if you're interested, let us know. Let us know if you uh, want to come along to a meet up. Um, Give us some idea of numbers anyway. Yeah, right? give us an idea of numbers. I mean, we had we had sort of like, I think it was 18 people last time had, had said yeah they were they were interested in coming. Um, I know we've got we've got subscribers all over the world now. Um, we've got quite a few in Europe. Um, um, oh, we've got quite a lot of French speakers. We have we have got a, a lot of French speakers. Uh, we've had quite a lot of our comments in French, which we've had to translate. Oui. Yeah. Uh, yes. No, have you done it as well? Uh, oui. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, yeah, so, well, you've done the translating. <laughs> what I know in French, you could write on the back of a postage stamp. Oh, I've got any Is it O U Y? Yeah. Yeah. Oui. Well done, you. Hey. Multilingual. Yes. We've had this discussion before, and I refer to our our um, Brussels vlog for that. Uh, so anyway, this is uh, this is daily vlog number three, I think. Yeah. Just to sort of keep you updated, and we've told you about the camper and why we don't have it. And um, oh, we're going to make use of it next year. Oh yeah, yeah. We've got, we've got. I think that's uh, that will probably be a uh, one of our discussions. One of our vlogs coming up soon is. Uh, well, I'm going to change my work-life balance as well. Aren't I? We are. We we're are. We're going to have a little chat about that, aren't we? We are. Yeah. yeah we're going to. Um, yeah. Stresses of working too many hours, and um, well, too much to do and not enough hours actually. Yeah. Taking its toll, isn't it? It is. So, um, for somebody that's really strong and resilient. Um, everybody has a breaking point, and I reached mine a couple of weeks ago, didn't I? You did. 
Um, so, it's been difficult. It's been a difficult few weeks. Yeah. When I'm ready to talk about it, we'll have a little chat. Yeah. Um, so everybody can understand that good mental health is, well, for me, who sees every everything is a win or lose situation it's been very difficult to come to terms with the fact that i'm not a superwoman so yeah um, and the fact she's admitted that she needs help is brilliant so yeah it well it still hurts to to admit that um i can't do it all um but yeah i needed a rest yeah. very much so so and it is generally those people that are the doers, the organisers, that make other people laugh, the ones that prop everybody else up, um, that are the ones that are suffering underneath mm. and find it the hardest to talk about it. And so, Covid's had a lot to do with it. Oh, solitude is my biggest um, enemy and there's been a lot of solitude yeah. for a lot of people in the lockdown. I mean, we're generally always laughing and joking and it does look like we have a charmed life. Um, but there's a lot of work that goes on in the background. We've both got to earn a living, pay our bills like everybody else. And we both work really hard, as most of you do. Or no doubt all of you do. You all work hard. We all work hard to have the things we like and we love. Um, I have a very stressful job um, that is, is a life or death job. Um, and you have a job where one number out or one word out can cost someone Thousands. millions of many, yeah. millions of pounds. So um, it, it is stressful. It is stressful. But yeah. that, trying to bring life back to an even keel. Yeah, that's uh, that's for another vlog. Yeah, I believe that's for another vlog. And um, and yes, yeah. what are you shouting at? Uh, oh, she's shouting at the seagulls over there. Uh -huh. And another vlog will be um, how we're planning how, uh, how we are planning our trip to Rome. As a marriage couple? Yes. Yes. So, can you wait? Can you wait? Hey, shush, shush, shush. Anyway, um, if you've liked our little um, daily vlog, give us a thumbs up. Um, yeah, give us a thumbs up. <laughs> if you don't already subscribe, please do so and um shouldn't that be like that rather it. than like that sorry okay. and then oh you gotta ring the bell haven't you yeah you, Winnie? what yeah. you gotta ring the bell for say notifications yes there we go. can you see her look can you see her she's quite a big girl now yes she is <laughs> uh, uh, she's just got to adolescence so she's going around shouting at everything yeah so we're shouting at her, stop shouting at everything. So if it moves, it gets shouted at. Yeah, she's a bit snappy, but... Right, we'll be back in the next one. Okay, okay. I'm here on my own now. Yeah, <laughs> we'll be back in the next one. All right, bye. Bye. bye.